Hello, in this JavaScript video, I am going to show you bitwise operators. These, you know, are really, really cool. So a bitwise operator actually, you know, operates on a binary level. Let me just show you. So if I create two variables and call it num1, assign the value of 12, let's do num2 equals eight, for example. And let's console.log for the first operator that I'm going to cover in the bitwise operators is the AND operator. And this is different to the AND operator from the logical operators. One, you write it with a single ampersand and it acts on a binary level and it's not to do with a true or false. It actually, it is, but it's more true or false on a binary level. Again, let me just show you. So num1 and num2. Let's just see what we get. We get 8. And you might be thinking, well, how do we get 8? Actually, let me choose slightly different numbers. 27, 22. We get 18. Okay. You're probably thinking, you know, if you don't know about binary operations and bitwise operators what the hell is going on so let me just actually write these out in binary down here let's write these out in binary so 27 in binary and let me just think one two four eight sixteen yeah well, we can actually just do it in five bit five bit binary so we can just do it as 16 8 4 2 and 1 so to get 27 let me copy this. To get 27, we need to put a 1 here and a 1 here. So we get 24. Not 1 there. So we put a 0, put a 1 there, and we put a 1 there. So we get 3, 11, 27. Fantastic. Let's copy this and let's do 22 in binary. And 22 in binary is 16. 24 is too big. 20. 22. And there we go. Okay, so these are the numbers in binary. So what it does is it puts them, you can think of it like on top of each other. So 27 and 22. And then what it does is it says that. 1 and 0, are they both, you know, on? Are they both true? No, they're not. So, one second, let me just put 0 everywhere and then I'll change it as I need to. So, 1 and 0 isn't on, so it becomes a 0. Is 1 and 1 on? Yes, that's number 1. Is 0 and 1 on? No, because only one of them is true. So, is 0, is 1 and 0 true? No, because it's the AND operator, both need to be true. So it's zero, is one and one, true, yes, they are both true. So we get 16 plus two, which is 18, and that's how you get the 18 right here. There is another operator, which is the bitwise OR operator, and it's just the single pipe. There's the exclusive OR operator, there's the bitwise NOT, the left and right shift, and right shift with zero as well. The principle is very similar if you watch the logical operator video, and there's really no point in me just you know going over this again as long as you understand what's going on here what's going on here and the logical operator video you'll be all good to go what i will do is provide a link with this tutorial which takes you to some amazing resources on bitwise operators how to use the other ones and you know a bit more in depth if you're interested in that and hopefully you are Thanks for watching. If you have any questions, feel free to pop me a message. There'll be a link to the GitHub page as well. And I look forward to seeing you in the next video.